uh, that the, the African Union should finance its own activities uh, because you know they say who pays calls the tune and if we really want to do what we want to follow our own priorities then we have to finance the activities of the Union uh, ourselves as Africa. Uh, now what impact will there be? Uh, not much because it's a minuscule percentage, I mean 0.2 percent uh, is a, a small amount and that will be a levy on imports uh, uh, which means that uh, 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 you know the eligible eligible uh, 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 imports from places outside Africa. Mm -hmm. So we think that uh, there will be little little uh, uh, adverse impact uh, as a result of that 0 0.2 uh, uh, percent. Uh, <clears throat> you know, uh, customs uh, offices will be the ones who will collect, that's the normal, they are the people who collect the, the tariffs and, and duties or, or any levy from outside, that's customs. And they will, of course, maybe uh, remit that to the revenue authority of the country. In most countries now, there are revenue authorities. Uh, that are autonomous uh, outside the Ministry of Finance, but even if they are within the Ministry of Finance, it doesn't make any difference. Uh, they will then pass on the proceeds to the account of the government in the central bank. The central bank is the normal banker of the government. We as individuals go to commercial banks. The government goes to the central bank bank. Central bank is the bank for bank for other banks in the country, but also a bank for the government. So these funds will be submitted there, there will be an account, and, and then from there, per instruction of the government, of the authorities, it will be transferred to the African uh, uh, Union. So this is how uh, it's going to, to work. Uh, I, I, I don't think so. Number one, ECOWAS is already doing exactly this. This is how it is uh, doing it within uh, ECOWAS. And lessons of experience have been learned from ECOWAS actually, as well as uh, ECAS, uh, because they are doing that. So a lot has been learned from, uh, from, from them. Uh, as for WTO, uh, I don't think so because no, you know we are now uh, moving towards um, continental free trade area. Now, as a continental free trade area, uh, then we become a unit, and and something like this can be applied without infringing any of the of the regulations. But while I did, I have to say that. I, I, uh, we, we have big question marks about WTO because we see uh, big countries not being interested in the Doha round anymore. Uh, agreements are now being done in snippets. They pick up here and there. And uh, the concept of development agenda, because it was